And welcome back to Pumpkin Plays! Today we're doing something a bit different. We are gonna do just some speed running through some stars to catch up till we make it through the next door. And a little extra for good measure. Yes, please, God. So, enjoy. Or um, don't, because... No. Please enjoy. I feel like, uh... Oh God, if I have to tell people to enjoy it, we're already lost. Okay. I want oh, to... Oh hey, great uh, star! No. <laughs> <laughs> You're a son of a bitch! Hey, I've been playing this for a long time now. A whole, uh, five buns. Splendiferous! Bitch flew right into it. Here we go. Is that your phrase? Is that what you're gonna say? <laughs> I go screw you. Bitch flew right into it. All right. That's one down. One down, that's what we can do. We can, well, unless we have two down. Oh, hang on, look, more diplomas on the wall. Oh, I was doing, um, I was... Get over it. <laughs> Got over it. I was doing diploma asshole voice for my mom and like getting into character, and she's like, "Oh my god, you are kind it's of scaring me." It's annoying as hell. Annoying like, for you, scary for her because. Oh, she finds it. Well, sometimes I say like really psycho things. You always say really psycho things whether you're in the voice or not. <laughs> yes, I um, I feel like he's becoming a part of me. Trevor was showing me a video of. Earth. How is he not a part of you? I, well, he is now. I'm, I'm just now realizing it. Because Trevor was showing me a video of Earl Dibbles Jr., who is the alter ego of Granger Smith. Sorry for the country talk, guys. I hate it. But who anyway. Who is Granger Smith? Country artist. Anyway, his. That would explain why I don't know him. Certain uh, celebrities have alter egos. And, well, okay, I'm not a celebrity right now. Damn it. But anyway, so uh, I've, always right wanted, I've always wanted to have an alter ego. And so I think he could be this guy. I thought about doing videos where I put what on- What about Kermit? I will take Kermit over him. No. Yes. Kermit's already a thing. That's just copycatting. That's boring. You guys want to hear me do Kermit? I'm too fucking no. bad. Because I'm now going to commit suicide. Oh, that's funny but funny. Poor Kermit. Anyway, um... I don't know why I'm not getting hurt or why I'm not hurting him. You need to drink more mushroom wine. What? My big lip wife. What? She loved oh, me. the plant. Yes! In real life, I'm married to a big lip wife. She's like, why are you talking uh, that way? And I say, to be sexy. And then I sleep on the couch in the front yard. Okay, um... Anyway, I, I was just thinking other. about, I think oh. for I think for one of these videos I should dress up in a sweater vest and uh, like oh, slick the my hair. Oh, blown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Either that or I thought about just doing little one-off things where I just sit around and talk like him. Just yeah, porn rimmed glasses? No. I have glasses and they look like what a psychopath would wear. And that's all for that. <laughs> <laughs> I would actually enjoy to see that. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what I'm Even though it's about. probably would be the last thing I see alive, but... <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, what, what is that? That's not, that's not him. Uh, yeah. Well, I can sit around and tell you guys what a day in the life of me is. You would not understand half of that, obviously. Because I would speak in Latin strictly. Because I know Latin. That was my 15th major. It's gay amsky. Mother, or uh, you dirty swine, speaking penguin. <laughs> Inferior. It's gay, it's gay, other fuck cray. I, I, I don't speak pig Latin. I don't either. I'm, I'm Are you just sure. making shit up? I tried to say motherfucker, but I'm pretty sure I did it wrong. It's like, I don't know. I think you it's put. Like you say the last part of the word, then the first part of the word, but you mix up the order of the words or something? It's something back ass words like that. Ass backwards ah. like that. See, you're speaking it already. Oh, good one, Thomas. Oh, look, two uh, bitch ran into it. There you go, whatever your catchphrase is. Thomas wanted to have a catchphrase for every time he get a gold star. Expects me to come up with it, obviously. I, I, not so we go on to the first star, and he says, bitch flew into it. There was my diploma on the wall. <clears throat> you could have given my diploma a pen and pencil, and it would have thought of a much superior catchphrase <laughs> for you, Tom asshole. <laughs> you're a douche. I do not recognize such words and slang. You fucktard. <laughs> uh, why do I have to be- uh, at least I'm not playing, but back at the water level. By the way, I was playing Skyrim and that- I was at a place with water and thick-ass frozen ice and it was nothing- and this was nothing compared to that. 
<laughs> I was freaking the hell out. Here I am underwater trying to put on my water walking boots. Nothing happening. I did not die though, so. Anyway. Well, today I went to the gym with- Mario's got some impressive hands right there. He does. I'm it's saying to handle a needle dick like that, that's impressive. I was gonna say he's trying to be Jesus in honor of Easter, piercing both those hands right up in this bitch. Um, hmm, I wonder who had the more offensive one there, <laughs> me and you. I don't know, I didn't insult Jesus, so... Just trying to see if I could pull the wool over somebody's eyes. Okay. <laughs> um, I went to the gym today with Trevor. That's right, this goes to the gym. <laughs> and, um... So I'm trying to work out and be all cool, and uh, there's not really a funny story to this, Get but... Swole, <laughs> what?! More words, I did not understand, <laughs> basically. No, anyway, I, I was lifting and I uh, almost hurt myself. You gave yourself a hernia? Hernia? No, I tripped over a cord, actually. <laughs> that is a lie. No, oh, my, I I, <laughs> no. you can you, see me doing that, I know. Knowing you, I can totally see you doing that. No, my my uh, this my shoulder, it wants to like pop back in a, into its own, I don't know, pop out of socket. I don't know what the hell it wants to do, but it hurts me greatly. Just, just like underwater levels. Uh, just like your voice. Oh no. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, I see why you would say that, Thomas. In high school, one time, Melise, uh, this girl, <laughs> um, yes, this girl. Um, she had she. What was her deal? I don't know. She pr broke. Some, I don't know what she did, but she had crutches, and I wanted. I so she, I. She she had a, a not very strong skeletal system. Like she had really bad scoliosis growing up, and I was born of the glass bones and paper, paper skin. skin. Anyway, so she had crutches, and uh, so she, we I, bought some awesome chocolate bar bag. Carrier we did bags not. We did her. not. We did not. All right. I'm and interrupting me. And um, so uh, <laughs> anyway, so I took her crutches. And I don't know how much. Well, she let me. She let me have her crutches <laughs> while she just stood there, and so I wanted to walk with them. And oh, uh, I forgot about that. I did not actually walk with the crutches the proper way you're supposed to walk with crutches. I put the. Uh, I just, Josh wanted to use the crutches like they're his cyborg legs, and he yeah, didn't have real. Yeah. So legs. I positioned them under my arms, and I pulled my legs up, and I got a good two and a half steps. And he ate. And I shit. ate shit on that tile floor. <laughs> uh, but after the reconstruction surgery, you have this. Face. Thanks for the compliment, Mom, that you're silently saying in your head as you watch this. <laughs> I'm like, look and for all of our blind fans, we really appreciate it. Look how far science has not come. That's right, I know. <laughs> he stitched me together with a dead hooker's face. <laughs> Prepare yourselves, guys. You're about to see this actual goddamn penguin's ass get beaten, get torn up by Thomas's dick. Sadie's like, what? <laughs> <laughs> she no! Looked, she literally this is not how I wanted it to go. This seems logical. Does <laughs> it not? Up. Does it not look Shut like up. If I were to race the penguin, I would simply kill the penguin. <laughs> Inferior based. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, what a... Oh! Slid right into that bitch. That's what Thomas is going to say. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Little catchphrases. I fit in Not the at the very end. Not at the very end. Oh, what? Oh, God. Oh, shit. What an idiot. What a stupid, swollen ass blue head. Uh, uh, uh. Where the fuck is my kid? He's saying. Oh, shit. You're like, this you kid is the one on the roof. That's the wrong You're one. raising him for his child. Because you're into that thing. What, raising an adopted penguin Shit! child? Yeah. I tried to slide right into that bitch. <laughs> Thomas, God. I'm an expert with such things. Sliding into them. It's like I slide through life. What am I doing on this YouTube? The YouTube. The YouTube. Um, yes. When we walked to the gas station, I was thinking, oh man. Um, I was thinking of a new kind of wallet. I, Cause I, as I went to the gas station, I was adjusting my belt and I was thinking about what people might be thinking of as I reached towards my pants. And then, I, and then it came to me, I realized. I need to make wallets shaped like guns. My this summer, the new blockbuster, the heartwarming family tale Based of a man. A oh, it's a novel. Based on a novel of a man who struggled to get a leg up in life. <laughs> the man who decided to follow that path and just keep putting one foot in front of the other. The man in search for a good pair of shoes. But the question is, 
were those shoes that he could fill. Follow us on our journey as we <laughs> look at the life story of No Legs McGee in a search for shoes, the novel.